Two spheres have surface areas of 36 cm2 and 49 cm2. If the volume of the smaller sphere is 20.2 cm3, calculate the volume of the larger one. Before solving this question, you need to understand some few things, and that is area scale factor, volume scale factor, and linear scale factor. Let me start with area scale factor. Area scale factor is the ratio of areas of two similar figures. Like in this case, you're given the areas of two spheres. One is 36 centimeters squared and the other one is 49 centimeters squared. From that, we'll be able to get area scale factor. Volume scale factor is the ratio of volumes of two similar figures. We need to get that. We are given the volume of the smaller one. So to get that, we need to get the volume scale factor. Linear scale factor is the ratio of the lengths of two similar figures. We will need to get that in order to help us to get volume scale factor. So let's begin from what you're given. You're given the areas, the surface areas of two, uh, these two spheres. So from these, we'll be able to get uh, what we call area scale factor. So very fast. So area scale factor. So area scale factor. Is given by. I will use the smaller one. 36. Divided by the larger one. Which is 49. That is the area scale factor. You also need to understand. The relationship between area scale factor and linear scale factor and this is the relationship that area scale factor is given by linear scale factor squared you get the ratio of linear scale factor then you square it or in simple terms you can say that linear scale factor is given by the square root of area scale factor so in this particular question, having the area scale factor, it is possible to get the linear scale factor. Because linear scale factor is given by the square root of 36 divided by 49. And this will give 6 divided by 7. After getting the linear scale factor, this will help us to get the volume scale factor. And therefore we need to know the relationship between linear scale factor and volume scale factor. So again, linear scale factor cubed will give volume scale factor. That is the ratio of volumes of two similar figures. And you require that because in this question, you are given the volume of the smaller one, you need to get the volume of the larger one. So we already have the linear scale factor, which is 6 over 7. So 6 divided by 7 cubed is equals to volume scale factor. 6 cubed will give uh, 216. Then 7 cubed will give uh, 343. Is equals to volume scale factor. Now this is volume scale factor. And it, if you can look at this one properly, you notice you're using the volume of the larger one, which is in the numerator. Then the smaller the smaller one is in the numerator. Then the bigger one is the denominator. So therefore, we're going to use these to get the volume of the larger one. So this means that if we get the volume of the smaller one, which is 20.2 divided by the volume of the larger sphere, which you don't know, you're looking for that. It should give us this ratio that you have obtained as volume scale factor, which is 216 divided by 343. So with this, X represents the volume of the larger sphere, and that is what you're supposed to get. So to get x, you just need to cross multiply 
and therefore you get x as 20.2 times 343 divided by 216. So work out these using a calculator and this one will give 32.08. Centimeters cubed. So that is how you're supposed to get the volume of the larger sphere.